<laughs> What's up guys, it's Pierre here from Gdansk in your pocket and um, today I'm in Gdynia. Now, whether you're able to recognize some of these landmarks, I'm not sure. That's the theater. Um, there's the city museum. There's the old uh, sailors club, one of the oldest buildings in the, in the center. And over this side is the sea towers. Whole bunch of apartments. They must have great views there. Um, I'm here in Gdynia on the recommendation of one uh, Nancy Stebnitsky, who's one of our biggest fans and has uh, recommended many, many places to us very uh, enthusiastically. Uh, today, she has recommended that I go to the Gdynia um, outlet of uh, Karmnik Kantina, which is like a burger um, restaurant. And she's told me that she was in Gdansk and she tried the uh, duck burger, the kachka burger uh, with hoisin sauce in Gdansk. And she said that uh, she highly recommends it. So today I'm here uh, and I've been keeping it very close to my bosom. My order from Karmnik Kantina in Gdynia. So let's open up and see what we have. The other thing I should mention is I also ordered a side of fries with mustard sauce with honey mustard sauce, but there are the fries, lovely golden in a little paper cone, and here is the honey mustard sauce. So let's give it a go, shall we? Just grab, I'll grab a few, grab a few for this little uh, test. Now they were probably quite crispy when we first picked them up, but they're a little soggy now. Um, I only waited about five minutes until I ate, so here's the first chip, honey mustard sauce. Smach nego. Mmm. The mustard bite is a little bit weak, but you know, perhaps it's commercially bought. It's probably not homemade. I highly doubt it is anyway. Uh, one more. The fries aren't overly crunchy, to be honest. Um, like I said, they didn't wait that long, so um, I don't think they really should be. But nevertheless, they're still they're still edible. Um, let's get to the main course. Got it stuck in the bottom here. Okay. Here is the package. Nice brown paper. And there she is. Kachka burger with hoisin sauce. There's also cold floor in there and some chili uh, by all accounts. Is that in focus? That's in focus there. Um, and it looks like, yeah, there's also carrot and stuff too. On this side, I'm definitely, I think I'm going to remove my gloves. Oh, a whippet. <laughs> Isn't this nice? There's a whippet in the park. Um, okay, there it is. Actually, the, just as I picked it up, a little bit of, little bit of duck fell out. Oh, it's pulled duck, so there you can see it just fell apart like you wouldn't believe. Okay, I skipped a little bit ahead. Ooh, mm, there's a lot of hoisting, <coughs> a lot of hoisting zim, zing there. All right, I'll try and do this quick, as quickly as, as possible. Jesus Christ. Okay, it's falling apart. It's probably a little bit too loose. Hang on. Jesus. Now, fortunately, since everything's fallen apart, I do have a serviette, so I will give you points for that. But yeah, just a little bit loose. A little bit loose, friends. All right, sorry. It's hard for, it's hard for you to see the workbench that's going on down here. All right, I got it. Solid, solid hold. There it is. Another piece fell out. All right, whatever. I'm going to judge it on taste. Not on the assembly, all right? Clear? Smachinego. Mmm. 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 A lot of hoisting zin, zing in this. 
and a lovely amount of crunch from this very beautiful coleslaw, this purpley coleslaw here, as well as the grated um, um, carrot. Sorry, I'm, I'm losing my words today. Um, the duck is beautiful, soft duck. And like I said, it's pulled duck. So it's very, it's, uh, it's falling apart nicely. It's practically melting in my mouth, to be quite honest with you. Mm. If I'm gonna be really critical about the toast, I would say that since I read the description that there is chili there, I can't really taste the chili, to be honest but it has a nice hoisin in. Hoisin, for the recommendation, is kind of like a soy sweet savory with a little bit of, I don't know how to explain it. It's kind of like a, maybe a little bit of, a little bit of kind of a vinegary sort of tone there as well. That's basically hoisin. But um, yeah, this is great. This is great. Just dealing with a little bit of the sauce here and there. Okay, anyway, Nyevajna. So, guys, this meal cost me uh, 30 zwatis. You can see it there. 30 zwatis. And, you know, fries and a nice burger with some very, very gourmet pulled duck. I think it's a pretty good value. So, presentation wise, um, I'll give this a four. Overall, uh, assembly. If I can add a new, uh, if I can add a new little category, the assembly part of this burger was a little, a little bit, a little bit weaker because it did fall apart very easily. Um, so I'll give the assembly of the burger a three. Uh, I'll give the taste. I'll give the taste three and a half, four. Okay. And as for the value of this meal, um, I will give. I will give the value. A four as well because uh, it's pretty good we're doing fairly well here okay so thank you nancy stepnitsky and um once again i want to thank everyone for your feedback on this series i hope you like the new aspect ratio uh, now that we're trying to put this on youtube as well um and you know give me your recommendations put them below i promise i'll get to as many as i can um, and we want to know about new places and places you think are good. Um, and in the meantime, don't forget to head along to facebook.com slash Gdansk in your pocket uh, and check out all the cool content that we post there about the Tri-City. Until next time, have a good week.